And so, I mean, yes, these these layoffs in big tech have really been kind of unprecedented. You know, Meta laying off, um, you know, thousands of people, Amazon, Salesforce really recently, obviously huge layoffs at Twitter. Um, what, what kinds of opportunities does that create for the startups in terms of their hiring? It, it does create both talent and then also it creates opportunity for more new startups to be started, right? So I think a lot of times, both the people who are laid off, but even I think the people who remain, uh, you know, they start to think, well, maybe I've been thinking about starting this company or joining this early stage startup, but I used to think it was too risky and I was in this really safe job, but maybe my current job isn't so safe anymore. Maybe now is actually a time to go out and start something. And interestingly, you know, if you look at the companies that were started or grew dramatically during the last two down cycles, so in the 08, 09, and then the 2000 through 2003, some really amazing companies were started and or grew during those time periods. Um, it turns out to be a really good time to be at a startup or to start a company because ironically, if you can actually raise the capital um, because it's so hard, you have less competition, right? Because fewer, fewer companies are able to raise that capital and you have less competition for that talent. Right. So um, it actually has turned out to be a really amazing time for tech startups uh, during, you know, their, their birth during these crisis periods, shall we say.